Hey, what's up guys? So I figured out the correct way to actually figure out what your chances are in drawing a card uh, first turn if you play three copies of it and you're playing 40 card deck. Uh, I'll put a link to this actual site so you can change all these numbers if you want to uh, change the amount of copies or change uh, you know how big your deck is so you can factor all that in. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Fushen for uh, sending me this link so thanks a lot because I'd be lost without it. So uh, first off, let's get started. So uh, first off, the population size, uh, that is how many cards you play in your deck. And then after that, the number of successes in the population is how many copies of that card do you run that you want to draw. And then for sample size, it would be six because, you know, first turn you draw six cards. And then for number of successes in a sample, just put one there and then it'll figure out for you. And what you're looking for is at the bottom right here, you're looking at the cumulative probability. And so that'd be um, 0.39, so basically 40%, uh, almost 40%, uh, 39. Uh, 39% basically, or 39-40% uh, drawing it first turn. But let's say that you are going second and you want to see for consistency of max C. So let's do that for example. So uh, let's say you're playing 40 card deck, you run two max Cs, and your sample size would be five. Because remember, when you're going second in Yu-Gi-Oh, you would have five cards, your opponent would have six, so you'd have five. And then let's do calculate for example. And give it a second here to, uh, come on, calculate. Okay, there we go. Uh, sometimes the site is a little bit slow. I don't know what's up with the site. Uh, but yeah, then you'd have a, uh, you, again, looking at the bottom, cumulative probability, that'd be a 23% uh, chance. So again, I apologize for my bad on that, but, uh, you know, me doing it wrong. I thought that kind of worked, though. It, it made sense to me that you could just add it all up. But yeah, um, there is a, a person that posted in the comments that, yeah, if you add it all of it up, when you have like 11 cards, then it would be 100%, which would be incorrect. So let, uh, let's, let's go ahead and do that. So uh, let's say that you were playing three and then your sample size was 11. Let's, let's check out what this would actually be. Um, that would actually be a 63% chance. Wouldn't it be a 100% uh, like uh, I would have actually gotten as my answer. So there you go. Uh, if you draw 11 cards, uh, I don't know. I mean, if you max seed them, they just go spam. You'd have basically a 63% chance to draw one of those cards that you play three of in your deck. So again, I'll put the link for this in the description. And again, I apologize, but hey, you know, I, I, I will correct myself if I'm wrong on things. Uh, and thanks a lot again for everyone that, uh, you know, posted in the comment and told me I was wrong because, you know, uh, you know, that's good that you guys you know, are sharing your feedback with me. And that way I can, you know, give you guys the, uh, the answers and, you know, update you guys because I will correct myself if I do make mistakes. <laughs> but yeah, so I'll put the link and you guys can go to town on that. Uh, let's go ahead and check out, uh, let's do... Uh, Let's do, let's do all of them, and then I'll put these all in the descriptions just so uh, people can uh, have them. Uh, so your sample size would be 6. So let's say if you're running two, uh, two of them, your chances are 28, and if you're playing uh, just one of them, your chances are 15%. So there you go. Then you have a, a pretty good idea of, uh, you know, my answers weren't, like, that far off. Um, I mean, they're, they're within, like, not really the necessary margin of error, but they weren't like way off. But yeah, if you go to higher numbers when you draw it, then my, my calculations would have been way off. But that said, there's a link for this in the description. Check it out. And that way you can factor in uh, what your chances are to draw certain cards. Uh, again, you mess with all those numbers. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions, just post in the comment section below. I'll, I'll help you guys out if you guys don't know what to fill in for the, the, the above boxes over here. But yeah, you don't want to fill in anything for the other ones. Actually, they don't let you, so you're good. You only have to fill in four boxes. Again, keep a uh, number of successes in sample. Keep that at one because you're just looking for one of them. Um, but uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I uh, hope this helps you guys out. Asian Dragons, signing out.